making him know that I know, and he know that I know, uh, uh, and uh, I just make him, they know that I know. Manel Cap, UFC flyweight contender. Outspoken racist. Homophobe. How based was Man Al Cap actually? Man Al is quickly becoming my favorite fighter. He's everything Sean Strickland wishes he was. Take a look at this insanity. Manel has retweeted a video of a black American abusing a Chinese. Look at this piece of shit. Bitch, I'm black American, you piece of shit. Chinese guy you kill. They in everybody's country. They in everybody's country, you fucking monkey. Monkey ass piece of shit. It, fucking black American hates you, you ugly monkey. Get the fuck out my country. You got your own country. Fucking monkey. See monkey? Michael Jordan, Kim Kardashian, fucking my race. Kanye West, you fucking monkey. You a monkey, you piece of shit. Black American hates you, you ugly motherfucker. To retweet this is wildly unhinged and based. We all know Alex Perez is a dirtbag, but did you also know he's a genetic abomination? Manel comes from slave-holding warrior genes in Angola. He is descended from the honor guard of Queen Njingamambamba herself. A woman who loves slaves, sex, and murder. Those are pretty good genes. As someone who comes from inbred stock himself, I can fully relate. We all know Davis and Figueredo is ungrateful and entitled. But did you also know he's a yellow livered pussy? I had to use my linguistics degree to get to the bottom of this one. Manal also called Figgy gay for being a barber. Because Manel comes from pure warrior genes and is a proud Christian just like his ancestors, he can spot a false prophet when he sees one. Manel isn't totally unhinged. He even has a wholesome alliance with a victim of racial abuse in Birmingham. Jake Hadley is forced by Leon Edwards and Jai Herbert to call himself White Kong. Manel is also trying to save Tim Elliott's honor. We all know Tim is a dirty cheater, but did you know his wife is too? You probably do, because he won't shut the fuck up about it. Imagine telling the world you're a cuckold. To conclude, Man Al Cap is about 8.7 out of 10 based. He scores extremely highly in overall aggression, lack of verbal filter, honoring his ancestors and culture, and homophobia. What's more, he is a casual eugenics enjoyer an anti cuckold. <laughs> Need I say more? Dima, mommy.